As a young boy, I was often called energy machine. I had a hard time sitting still. So many things about the world interested me. And I always seemed to have the need to be on the move. I like running around, playing in the dirt, getting in trouble climbing trees a little too high. Stuff like that. Then something was introduced to my life that, unlike schoolwork or movies, I could sit down and concentrate on with an endless reserve of attention. That thing was video games. From the early days of going down to the arcade and spending all the quarters you could fish out of the couch to try and be the next boss with your friends, to present day online gaming with your friends quarantined miles away, video games have embedded themselves into modern culture. There are games full of lore and wonder, games with puzzles you can solve on your own, games you can challenge your friends with, and games that tell stories as compelling and impactful as any modern novel or movie could. Some people say games just aren't for them, but there really are so many options. You have tons of ways to play. Casual phone games, computer and console games, handheld games, arcade games, or virtual reality. There are so many genres to choose from. RPG, puzzle, shooter, adventure, racing, dancing, sky's the limit. Others contest that video games are bad for people, leading to violence, antisocial behavior, and ADHD. While I'll concede that the immersive nature of video games requires a bit of self-control, gaming can have positive and healthy effects on people. Studies have shown, like in my case, that gaming improves problem solving and actually helps people with ADHD. A study of information technology students even showed evidence that those who played video games heavily had higher GPAs than those who didn't. Regardless of your personal feelings about it, Video games are at least worth a shot. According to USA Today, two-thirds of Americans play video games, and that number is only rising. Won't you join us in our virtual worlds? If you look hard enough, I'm sure you'll find something you like.